Hello and welcome to another episode of Book Club, where I read and you fucking listen. Today we're reading a book called Whores for Gloria by William Volman. This book is for my family. I have no idea what this book is about, but Whores for Gloria sounds cool. I need to watch myself on this episode. There's no pictures. What am I supposed to read? Chapter 1. The Album. We all know the story of the whore who, finding her china white to be less and less reliable a friend no matter, recalled in desperation the phrase, shooting the shit, and so filled the needle with her own watery excrement and puffed it in, producing magnificent abscesses. Chapter 1. This is the first two sentences. When they collected a sample of his urine, it melted the plastic cup. What? How? All of the whore's tales herein, however, are real. What do you say? This book is for my family? Your family's into some weird shit, dude. The chapters are pretty short, and I like that. And they're all kind of like, cool titled, just like names, basically. The Redo leaned up against the fire hydrant, crossing her legs and waiting for some stoop to offer her money so she could write him a ticket. Hmm. So she's a police officer, whore? Her partner, Leroy, who was new, sipped at his orange crush and spotted her like a good boy. That sounds hot. This street was full of night sharks. <laughs> nope, can't read that out loud. No way. Gloria, what did the doctor say? Are you crying, Gloria? If I can buy you a plane ticket tonight, will you come tonight, Gloria? Yes, Gloria, you can take a taxi cab to the airport, can't you? Gloria, Gloria, I got some money. I can give you some money. Are you going to have my baby? I got lots of money now. When are you going to get the abortion? Wait a minute, you said you're going to take care of the baby. Whatever's cheap is how much? 80 bucks, you're fucking kidding me. Can I jerk off to you? Wow, you didn't even hang up on me. <laughs> This dude just said I've never cheated on any one of my woman, even when I was going up with all three of them at the same time. Tell me how that makes sense. If you're still with me, I'm on page 72. The Comeback Club. Come is spelled with a K. And back is spelled without the C. A few months back, Jimmy had had a Korean whore who was real good and tight. I like Korean food. That's all I'm going to say on that. Because that's Korean for come back, isn't it? And I always come back to you? Whoa. You crazy. <laughs> oh. Jimmy didn't say that. That was the whore. I need to get my shit together. You just a big, white, crazy boy. Don't be that. During happy hour, a Budweiser and a coffee were only $2. That's actually a good fucking... Get some money! This book is for my family. Peggy in Classic. Now, Classic is an interesting character. In fact, I don't know anything about Classic. I'll just stick it in you real quick, said Jimmy. And afterward, you can tell me stories. Now, that sounds like a nice time. The fuck is going on? That, that stinking bush of hers really resembled a black spider. Lurking there and clinging there? Peggy raised her ass high and dry to make it easy for Jimmy to get into it. I can't read this. I can't. I wish these walls were soundproof. Whoa. Not saying that. Not saying that. Not saying that either. This is. F wow, this is for my family. I don't think I'm going to give you any more breaks around here. Just pay your fucking rent. Remembering the porno message. And he used the money to call a lesbian porno message. Do people still do that? And the phone clicked and licked like a girl and snapping her dress. And Jimmy held his dick in his hand and listening. And the message moaned. Biting your tongue off. What? There's a lot of sex in this book. I guess the name kind of was true to itself. Is that right? Laughed Jimmy, staring at Candy and choking as he 
jerked himself off. This book should be called Jimmy Jerks Off. Because it's all about Jimmy just getting action left and right. And Candy said Gloria, and Candy said hmm, and Candy said you meet all kinds in this job, I'll tell you. The sentences are like r really weird. They're like dr like long, long sentences. It's very hard for me to get through this because I don't know how to read. Nipples. She come blazing and blood was blasting. Those words are italicized. So, and the Chinamen were fucking splitting. You know how a motherfucking slope is, man. That was something. That was hard. To read. Hard to read. <laughs> well, there you have it, folks. Whores for Gloria. A book that takes you through the life of multiple prostitutes and the perspective of Jimmy as he jerks off everywhere. I definitely recommend this book if you're into that kind of action. And, and I mean all kinds of action. This one was for his family. You can find this book in the links I posted down below. If you like this episode of Book Club, Please like, subscribe, recommend a book you'd like to see me read next, and I will do it. Because I have nothing else to do. This book took me about 12 hours to get through, but we did it. Can you imagine reading a book out loud for that long? It's hard. This has been an episode of Book Club, and I will see you next time. Holy shit. Did you ever get that phone number where you can call the suck me, suck me, suck me line?